Hello, Cloud Solved IT users. I'm Martin Montoya, and I am here to bring you another installment of our remote app series, but this time on a Chromebook. Why a Chromebook? Because uh, they're out there, and you can actually do almost anything you can on your PC, on your Mac, on your Chromebook. That's how uh, that's how abstract the world of computing has become. So with that being said, uh, this video is going to center around um, the setup and installation of remote app from our Chrome based device. Uh, I'm going to set up the screen sharing here so you can see what I'm doing on the big screen. There you go. Now you can see my screen. Um, much like Apple devices, you are required to have a Gmail account and this is to access the Google Play Store uh, where you're going to be getting your Android and Chrome based uh, applications. Uh, I've already got an account set up. If you need help getting your account set up, please feel free to give us a call. We're always happy to help. Uh, with that being said, we're going to dive right into the download and setup of this app. So we're going to start by pushing the Google Play Store icon here. And this is going to bring us to the Google Play App Store. I'm going to do a quick search for remote desktop. If I can spell remote desktop. And uh, I'm going to see here in the results, uh, Microsoft Remote Desktop at the top here. I'm going to click on that. And I'm going to push the install button. Okay. Now that the application is installed, I'm going to click the open button here. And you're going to see it appears in the uh, toolbar down here, or the dock or the start bar. Uh, I'm going to right click on it and hit pin so it stays on my toolbar. And let's dive into the app setup. So I'm going to click accept because if I don't accept this license, I can't use it. And just like the iPad or iPhone, you're going to see the Microsoft Remote Desktop client and it's going to say, it's lonely in here because we haven't set up a connection yet. So uh, let's set up a connection. To do so, you're gonna push the little plus in the top right corner of the screen, and you're going to select a remote resource feed because we're not connecting to a desktop, we're connecting to cloud resources. I'm gonna enter the email address associated with the account. So demo at cloudsolvedit.com. And I'm gonna hit this little drop down here, and I'm gonna add the user account so it saves my information in the client. So again, demo at cloudsolvedit.com. Enter your password. And hit save. And now when I push save, it's going to say, oh, discovered the remote resource feed, remote.cloudsolvedit.com. That's me. And those are the apps I want. So I'm going to hit save again. And within seconds, you can see all the applications have opened up in the application feed on my Chromebook. Super simple. Username, password, two minutes of your time. Now, I'm going to click on the QuickBooks Pro icon here just to test it. And there you go. I click the QuickBooks app, QuickBooks starts, and I'm on a Chromebook. Pretty cool. Let me close out of the app here. Turn off my screen sharing. And just like that, Chromebook, running QuickBooks in the cloud. Apple, MacBook, PC, Surface, doesn't matter. The device does not matter. Here at CloudSolved IT, we can help you run any application you have in or from the cloud. I wanna thank you guys for taking the time to watch this remote app Chromebook setup video. Uh, please like, subscribe, or even comment. Leave us some details. Tell us what videos you want to see, how, uh, how you want us to develop videos so that you can operate better in the cloud. Again, I'm Martin Montoya with CloudSolvedIT.com, serverless solutions that work.